I am Dr. Kilroy. I am the emergency room doctor today. Don't mind the body on the table. He was brought in by Rescue 85 from the nursing home, and they left his hearing aids there. But that is another story. I understand that you were brought in by the ambulance for having some chest pain. It is so bad right now. I really need something strong. I just can't take it any longer. And those idiots on the ambulance would not give me any medications. I don't have any money to pay for this, so I don't want a lot of tests. What were you doing when the pain started? It started when the judge called my name. My chest got real tight, I got very dizzy and I was having some trouble breathing. My left arm is tingling and my lips are numb. When am I going to get some pain medications? This is a hospital, isn't it? Are you even a doctor? Are you allergic to any medications? I am allergic to narcaine, aspirin, nitro, epinephrine, atropine, tylenol, ibuprofen, snake bites, darvocet, vicodin, naprosin, narcaine, ultram, ultracet, teradol, odors, shark bites, phenagon, reglan, compazine, narcaine, zofran, penicillin, narcaine, sulfur, batrapin, rosephine, peanuts, eggs, strawberries, bubonic plague, Narcane, lightning, babies, metals, latex, tape, narcane, and bee stings, and odors. <coughs> what does this have to do with my pain? I just need something for the pain. The other emergency rooms give me that medication that starts with a D. Die. Do. Did it. Did it or something like that. I am not going to give you the lauded for your pain. What kind of medical history do you have? Who is you, doctor? I do not have any medical problems, but I'm on disability for my back pain. I fired my pain management doctor two weeks ago after I moved here. Can you recommend one for me? Oh, and I'm out of my medications and need to get them refilled. And while I am here, can I get this spider bite on my buttocks looked at? It is very painful as well. And I am hungry and I need something to eat. Your EKG and your lab work are all fine. It looks like you are suffering from incarceritis, not a heart attack. I checked with Walgreens and it looks like you had some Percocet filled yesterday and Xanax 120 tablets two days ago and Oxycontin 80 mg 400 tablets filled this morning. You know it is illegal for you to ask for me to refill your medications I am going to have to call the police it wasn't me it 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 was my twin brother he is always using my ID to get illegal medications he is a druggie wait till I see him again I am really going to kick his ass excuse me for a second my girlfriend is calling and I need to take this call it's a business call Judy, no Judy, I don't think he is going to give a script for anything. Sorry Doc, you know how girls are. I forgot to tell you that I will need a ride home when you decide to let me go. I do not want to rush you, but I need to meet someone in an hour so could you please get me something for my pain. Look here dumbass. Do you think that I would give you any medications? You are going to come into the CR as an overdose, and I will have to save your ass. You are not worth the time or my effort. It wasn't the drugs that put me in that coma last time. It was those dumbass paramedics that shoved that tube down my throat and filled my veins with atropine and epi, which I am allergic to. My lawyer said that I am going to be rich after the case settles. If they would have just let me sleep it off, I would have been fine. Now can I just get a shot? You have got to be kidding me. You are not getting a shot and you are not getting any scripts. I am going to refer you to the health department for your medical needs after the police are done with you. I don't want to see your sorry low life drugged out dumbass piece of shit scumbag. From Nokamis. Waste of time. Hooded punk ass. In my ER again. You waste of human flesh.